to make transactions on the network cost increases significantly, he also wanted to address that as well. And so it's a very, very low cost. We're talking about negligible cost sub pennies, basically negligible because the applications can even abstract that away from the user and essentially pay your quote unquote gas costs on your behalf. So high throughput, low cost, very flexible. That's one thing that's really important too. And this idea that, again, putting yourself back in 2017, 2018, whenever networks wanted to upgrade, it typically required, and still to this date on, on some of them, requires a hard fork in the sense of splitting up new token, having to split up the community. Doing an upgrade is, is quite tedious. It's very difficult. So what EOS does as well, that is quite unique in the way that it does it, is that essentially EOS hard forks or soft forks continuously, every time there's an upgrade, the end user doesn't see that. 